What's good, YouTube family? Back at it with another video. You know what I'm saying? Don't mind me. I know my breath probably looks stank. I just woke up like 20 minutes ago. Looks stank. Probably, probably stank. So, two days from now, it's my girlfriend's birthday. But due to the fact that we always are super busy, we always got different schedules, it's hard to find some free time, you know, um, I'm deciding to do everything today. So, um, today, I'm uh, just pretty much trying to spoil her a little bit, you know, I can't do what I want to do just because of COVID, you know, I had a lot more planned for her, I had a, um, like a birthday dinner plan for um at a nice restaurant. I was gonna have some friends come out, it was gonna be a surprise birthday dinner and everything like that. But, you know, COVID is COVID and people that we knew was catching COVID, she caught COVID and then so I just I just canceled everything. Like I was just like, you know what, bump it. So Everything going to be carry out today. You know what I'm saying? We ain't even going out to eat, just me and her. I'm going to just get her some carry out from a, from a restaurant we like to go to. Um, and then I got a little gift for her, you know, today. And, you know, it's going to be more gifts throughout the month because I, I want to make this birthday a little special for her. I'm about to get up, wash up, get shower and all that, go get her some breakfast. You know what I'm saying? Go get her some Coney Island. Can't go wrong with Coney when you're from Detroit. Can't go wrong with a good Coney Island breakfast. Because one thing you are going to get when you go to a Coney Island for breakfast, you're going to get so much food when you go to a Coney Island here. You know what I'm saying? Because the Coney Islands here, make sure that you eat good. They don't cheat you at the meal. Like They don't cheat you by giving you just a little bit of food. They make sure that they, they pack your plate. You know, so I'm going to go get her some breakfast take a tour, and then her gift's supposed to get here at, like, 12 o'clock, so I'm gonna go scoop her a little gift or whatever, and then, um, uh, say that for, for dinner, having dinner at, um, just gonna have dinner at my house, get carry out, bring it back to my apartment, and then, uh, yeah, so, let's go. So, you about to slide, go get this food, hopefully, she ain't cook already, listen, I'll just, I just want to publicly announce this, that my girlfriend is probably one of the hardest people to surprise. Because every time somebody want to surprise her, she ends up doing what the person was going to do for her or getting what the person was going to get for her. So I'm hoping that everything goes according to plan. She was talking about last night getting the shoes that I got for her. She's been talking about these shoes for, for months. So I was trying to, you know what I'm saying, wait until her birthday to get them. And then last night, all of a sudden, she was talking about some... Oh, I did say I wanted to get them shoes, and I'm in my mind, like, please don't get these shoes. I'm trying to surprise her, but she's so hard to surprise. So I'm hoping she ain't trying to, like, cook no breakfast or nothing like that. Hoping that she, um, she chilling so that I can surprise her with some, some food. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully, hopefully it's hard. It'd it be hard sometimes. I got the, got the food. Now I'm just praying that she ain't start cooking nothing for herself. Hope she's just chilling right now. Cause if she is cooking, I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna be hurt. I'm gonna be salty cause I just bought two omelets. Part of me wanted to just buy one, just in case, you know what I'm saying? She was cooking and then I could just eat that one. But then I thought, well, what if she not cooking? You know, what if she not cooking? Then I'm gonna have to give her the omelet and I'm gonna just be sitting there hungry. So hopefully, hopefully she's not cooking. Hopefully. Good news, she hasn't started, she hasn't eaten anything yet. This is why I love the fact that she prays. That she was just praying and reading her Bible. So it make it easier sometimes to do stuff like this because she don't eat until later in the day because she be, you know, praying and stuff. So thank God that she has a prayer life. You know what I'm saying? Because... It's helped me get my surprise off. <laughs> I sure do appreciate you. <laughs> you funny. You funny. Huh? <laughs> I got food. Mm. 
I got you a Western omelet. That's why I asked you what you wanted for breakfast yesterday. Or what you like for oh, breakfast. Oh, aren't you crafty? I try to be, you know? I try to be crafty. I was going to come in here with one because I was like, damn, what if she cooked? I would have been mad. But then I was like, dang. Maybe I should just... Maybe I should just get two. Because I was hoping that you hadn't eaten. I mean, I've only been up for a couple hours. You put salsa on your, on your omelets? Yeah. You Mexican? See, si. If you've never tried it, you can't knock it. So, please, save me your judgment. Save it! It's weird to me. Though. Save it! To each time. Yes, This boy indeed. is heavy. Huh? This boy is like. And it's over there leaning. I'm about to say it look. It's got a bubble <laughs> on the back of it. It's a booby on the bottom of my plate. Dang, you didn't bacon or nothing? It didn't come with no meat. I mean, it's a Western omelet. It got ham and stuff in it. Oh. You still order bacon, babe? Hmm. They only gonna give you like four pieces, and they gonna charge That's... like seven dollars for four pieces of bacon. Sorry, I didn't want to get no bacon. Babe, hey, you got to do better. You got to do better. You, 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 you need to know. You need to learn how to dance so you can catch me. Catching you ain't got nothing to do with me not knowing how to dance. Catching has got everything to do with you telling me you about to fall. So I can't catch you. Breakfast time is over. I have the itis. So I'm about to take me a nap. And then we're going to care of prison. Packers then came on through, you feel me? Right. Every time I plan something, something gotta go wrong, it seems like. Like I always gotta, I always gotta improvise on my plans because the way that I plan things out never play out how I planned it out. So I called a restaurant to place the order for the carryout. They talk about so they ain't doing no carryouts for the rest of the day. It's only six o'clock, bro. Like, how you ain't doing no carryouts for the rest of the night and y'all open till y'all kitchen open till eleven o'clock? You feel what I'm saying? And y'all not super busy. Like, it's a Tuesday. You know what I'm saying? So now I gotta figure out another restaurant to eat at that I can get some carryout. They be praying on my downfall. I know it, bro. I got the I got the food. We eating Jay Alexander's tonight. I did get the food late. So hopefully the food not cold. I went to the wrong location and I don't know how I did that. I thought I, I thought I ordered for a certain location, but I guess I didn't. So I'm a little behind, but you know, she's still getting ready, still doing her hair and her makeup and stuff. So I, I think I'm gonna be all right. I ain't gonna be too late. I'm just hoping the food not cold. I'm not going to lie, I'm irritated. For one, I forgot to order her dessert. Then with her steak, it said it came with a potato. So I ordered a loaded baked potato. I get to the restaurant. I ask the lady, I look the lady dead in her eye, right above the mask, right here. I ask the lady, is there a baked potato with the New York street? She told me yes. Look inside the bag. When I look at the New York strip, there's no loaded thing. This is why you always double check your stuff, bro. I, I should have known better. I should have knew better. I took her word for it. Because of the establishment. I figure, you know, it's Jay Alexander. Like, they be on their stuff. They be on point. 
Can't put it past nobody, man. Birthday girl's here. Ain't she fine? Look at her. That my baby. That my baby. Oof. It's time to know who's gonna open her gift now before we eat. So I want to see her reaction to her gift. So we doing this now before we get, cause I know I'm hungry. Look at those scissors. Right there, right there. So now, you know. It ain't much, but you know. Did what I can. Did what I could. <laughs> Got her. See, you just made my night better by that reaction. Thank you. <laughs> I needed it. I needed that reaction. It means a lot to me. Thank you, baby. You're welcome, boo. Baby. You're welcome, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Did you have a good night, babe? All right, y'all, that's the end of the birthday vlog. I gotta get her some new shoes, cause these ones don't fit. Nike, you gotta do better. Be true to size, bro, that's all it takes. But it's the end of our vlog, man. Peace out, till next time. Fresh out the sky, jump in the whip, on to the next, yeah. Been grinding all night, moose put together, the crew can attest. Now lucky I'm blessed, this is God doing no regular flex Ball like the pros, look out for my dogs, I feel like the vet, yeah